You're invited to see the action up close. NBC 10's Miguel Martinez Valle, he is live along the Schuylkill River. Not too many people around you right now, Miguel. Where are you exactly? So we moved even closer over to the Schuylkill to kind of watch the race. The fans, they're actually a little bit farther up over where we were last half hour in the stands. But you can see the athletes, they have taken to the Schuylkill to compete. Now, it's exciting that fans are allowed this year, seeing as last year there were no fans allowed. And in 2020, the event itself was canceled. So Mayor Kenny is pointing at this event and at the progress that we've made during the pandemic. It's nice to be able to convene and come together and see each other and talk to each other. Um, you know, uh, we've had lots of issues relative to masking and vaccines and, and boosters and all kinds of stuff, and we're, we're, we're coming out of a long nightmare. Now here on the Schuylkill, that means friends and family cheering on the rowers. This prestigious regatta, it dates back to 1934. And this year there will be 175 races over these two days with more than 100 colleges from all across the country. That includes our local schools, Drexel, Penn, Temple, and St. Joe's. And Drexel is actually the reigning points champion. So, but fans, they are pouring in from all over. They are allowed back on the grandstands and they'll be lining up. They've been cheering along the Schuylkill River. It's great. It's, out, it's We're having a blast out here. They have a great setup out here. It's good to be down in Philly for a day. Uh, so, good time. So if you are thinking of heading down, it is a free event. You can watch along the Schuylkill. Uh, it's happening today and tomorrow. I'll send it back to you. I'm Miguel Martinez-Valle, NBC 10 News. That's great. All right, Miguel, thank you so much.